from early simplistic machines of long ago to the modern naval power of today, man has attempted to harness the power of steam. In times of war and peace, steam energy has allowed us to conquer monumental tasks with greater strength and greater speeds. The invention of the modern steam engine single-handedly changed our civilization. The change helped to usher in the machine age and started the Industrial Revolution. By the early 20th century, steam was the lifeblood of modern industry and transportation. What is one of the greatest examples of supreme ingenuity and technology from the pinnacle of the steam age? The ocean liner RMS Queen Mary. Hello, my name is Alex. On my YouTube channel, I go by the stage name Alex the Historian. Now, the video presentation you just saw has never been seen by anyone before. And the reason for that is because it used to be part of something called the Yarrow Project. Now, the Yarrow Project was created in the early 2000s and designed by Fog Bank Industrial Arts. A group of people came together to create the Yarrow Project, and the idea was that it would replicate two of the Queen Mary's original boiler rooms in order to create an entertainment and education complex at the bottom of the ship that would lure in tons of new visitors year after year. Now, in order to do this project, they needed to create a video presentation that they could show to investors and anyone interested, basically. They were able to get Academy Award-winning actor Ernest Borgnine to voice the narration for the entire video project. They brought him in for a two-hour recording session, and he delivered those amazing narration lines. Unfortunately, around that time, the Queen Mary underwent a change of management, and with a change of management came a change of direction. The Yarrow project was permanently put on hold, and the video presentation was never completed. Now, about a month ago, I was speaking to one of the people who was involved in that project, Stephen Ablonsi, and he happened to mention that he had all of the original Ernest Borgnine narration. And so I offered to complete the video project by putting images to that narration and adding sound and other special effects. And so, folks, for the first time in 12 years, you will be able to see and hear the Yarrow Project experience at least from the presentation standpoint. And who knows, maybe in the future, the presentation can be used to revive the project. I'm really excited for this, not just because Ernest Borgnine was involved, but also because all the folks at the Yarrow Project never really got closure on it, and perhaps seeing the completed video project would give them a little bit of that. The next thing to come is an extended trailer of what you just saw. And then after that, you will see a three-part series, the first part being voiced by Ernest Borgnine, and it is a short documentary about the RMS Queen Mary. The next video is going to be also voiced by Ernest Borgnine, and it will feature all of the ideas put into the Yarrow project. For the first time, you'll be able to see in detail what the Yarrow project was. And then the third part will be a behind the scenes project narrated by myself, showing what it took to create the Yarrow project and interacting with Ernest Borgnine for doing the narration. Anyway, folks, there's a lot to unpack here. There's a lot of things happening in the coming months on this channel, so stay tuned for all of it. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.